Hello and welcome to a tutorial on how to use hit film to express and detonationfilms.com explosions. All right, let's get into it. First, uh, we've got hit film to express open. I'm going to start a new project. Uh, I like to set mine at 1080p for YouTube 29.97 and we'll start the editing. First thing we're going to do is import some media. So I'm going to go into uh, some previous footage that I took of an epic Angry Bird War. Here's the yellow Angry Bird. and We'll just take this guy here, click and drag him down into the editor. Next, I'm going to assume that you have some explosions downloaded. And I save my best explosions here. This is one of my favorites, the DV Ack Ack explosion. Uh, because it's got, uh, it's pre keyed and it's also a uh, burst explosion. Now you could take this fader here and slide it back and forth to cut out the uh, initial detonation film header information and just let that go and then you can pull this down right here into the video 2 box and what you got here is you see this little dot here you can use that as a pointer to where you want the explosion to occur and I'll take this and stick it on a yellow bird's eyeball and then I can come over here to the explosion click the side of the uh, explosion footage there and just match it up with the yellow bird footage and then we'll hit play to see if we like it you could hear our awesome sound effects of explosions alright so let's say if I wanted to make it a little bigger on the explosion there I can just take this and expand it out hit play again ah oh, yeah that's pretty good right there. And you can see the the first version is the regular starburst and the next one is the Twixerized slow version. And then you can edit in audio uh, later on to make your explosion sound more realistic. You can add shadows and whatnot. Alright, but that does it. Thanks for watching.